Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we will be talking about the Hey Hue Paint Warrior Palette. If you want to see how these paints work and what I think about them, then please keep on watching. Alright, so as I have mentioned, today we will be talking about the Hey Hue Paint Warrior Palette. And this is what the palette looks like. It is actually huge. And once you open it, you will see 12 pans inside. There are 12 shades in total. No, not actually 12 shades. There are 11 shades in total, 10 of which are vibrant colors. And then the, these two pans are both white. Now, one thing that I really like about this palette is how each pan is actually detachable. So before I show you guys the swatches of all the shades and the demo of how I use this palette, let me tell you guys about this palette first. So the Paint Warrior palette retails for 899 pesos and includes 12 coconut oil infused face and body paints. They are said to be thick and creamy in consistency and offers a full coverage. The formula is also hand mixed and can be used by both adults and children. Also, it is safe to use for those who have sensitive skin. Now having that said, let me swatch all of the shades for you guys. Alright, so for the first three shades, here we have a white shade, a brown shade, and a black shade. So right off the bat, you can see how pigmented and opaque these are. Yeah, so these are the neutral colors in the palette. Next, we have these three beautiful shades. We have a pink, an orange, and a red. Again, super vibrant. That pink is my favorite. I actually used it as blush yesterday and it lasted the whole day. Next, we have these two shades, the green and the yellow shade. And finally, we have these three gorgeous blue shades. This one is a classic royal blue. This one is a medium blue that's almost periwinkle. And this one is so stunning. It's so pretty. It's somewhere in between a teal and a sky blue shade. Alright, so now that I've swatched all of the shades for you, let me show you guys a demo of how I use these paints. It is also a way for you guys to see how easy the application and the blending process is. Also, I want you guys to see how smooth it, the product is because I did try this already last night and I was blown away. So, let's go ahead and do that. Alright, so I'm not done with my eye look yet. However, I just wanted to show you guys that ha this is how the um, pastel or the lighter colors look like on the eye. Um, it does crease, of course, because it is a cream formula. And that is why I'm showing this to you now. So you can see what they actually look like before I set them with some eyeshadow. Alright, so this is the final look that I came up with. As you can see, I created this butterfly-inspired eye look. And I did use the paints for this. As I have mentioned earlier, I did set some of the colors. Most of these base colors I set with some eyeshadow. Also, as I've showed in my demo earlier, it's very easy to create new shades by mixing these colors. It doesn't really take a lot of effort. All you need is a mixing palette or if you don't have a mixing palette, you can mix the shades over on your the back of your hand or on the palette itself. Because, again, so again, this is what the palette looks like. You can actually use the lid or the top of this palette as a mixing palette. In terms of consistency, they are very smooth and creamy, which makes the application a lot easier compared to other paints. Also, I love how opaque, vibrant, and pigmented all these colors are. 
They are also very, very, very easy to blend and they are all easy to use. They are all so easy to manage. As I've mentioned, they are creamy and you don't really need to work on them for a very long time to achieve a good look. Also, I tried this out yesterday and it stayed on my eyes for around 2 hours and I'm really happy to report that these paints do not stain the eyelids. They do not stain the face. Also, another pro is that they stay on your face for a long time even if you sweat. However, they are also very easy to remove. So to remove this yesterday, all I did was take a reusable cotton round, wet it, and just wiped it off. And that completely took it off. I also like the fact that you can use this palette for a long time. Um, usually with face paint palettes, they go bad in just a few months. But this one, you can actually use for 24 months upon opening. So you can use it up to 2 years. And finally, I love the idea behind the detachable pans. Because for example, if you're not, if you're someone who likes going to parties, Halloween parties and such, or if you have an event to go to, and you only need to bring a few colors with you. You don't really have to bring this whole palette around because it is kind of big. It's not actually bulky, but it is big. Um, so if you need, for example, you just... For example, you only need the white one for retouch. You can just take that out. Um, it's not that easy to take out. I pushed all of my palettes in already because... Well, I'm not planning on taking them anywhere individually naman. But if you want to do that, you have the choice or you have the option to do so. And that is pretty much it for this review. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you haven't. All of my social media handles will be listed down below. So go ahead and check that out if you want. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you all in my next video.